Hey there, and welcome back to another episode of our monthly trends blog. Today, we're going to talk about the recession that's on everyone's mind and the most popular platform for outreach in 2023. So grab your favorite drink, sit back and join me on our next trend adventure for 2023. So what's all this talk about a recession? I hear about it everywhere and from tons of people around the world. Are we on the brink of a recession? This is our first trend for today, so let's talk about it. In recent times, discussions about an upcoming economic recession have been on the rise. On one hand though, a recession can bring about negative economic impacts such as job losses, business failures, and reduced economic activity. On the other hand, a recession can also provide opportunities for innovation, reevaluation, and growth. When you hear recession, naturally your mind is drawn to the negatives, but in this video, we'll discuss both the positive and negative aspects of an upcoming recession and explore how we can get through it together. Negative aspects. According to some economic forecasts, a recession may be on the horizon. There are loads of resources that talk in depth about this recession that has everyone so worried. One of the many reports available talks about how economic growth may slow down in 2023 due to such factors as rising debt levels, geopolitical uncertainty, and demographic shifts. For example, PwC found that many CEOs are concerned about the potential impact of the recession on their businesses, with the majority planning to cut costs and reduce headcount in response. It is important, however, to remember that a recession doesn't necessarily mean an economic crisis. While a recession can be challenging for individuals and businesses, it's also a normal and expected part of any economic cycle. The Economist notes that while there are some signs of economic weaknesses, such as slowing growth in China and Europe, there are also reasons for optimism, such as low inflation and low unemployment rates in many countries. Positive aspects. A recession can also provide opportunities for innovation, reevaluation, and growth. One of my sources suggests that a recession can be a time for businesses and individuals to take stock of their priorities and make strategic investments in areas that will drive long-term growth. The American economy is set for a downturn, but not a crisis. And the article argues that a recession can be a time for policymakers to make structural reforms that will strengthen the economy in the long run. One potential positive impact of a recession is that it can spur innovation and entrepreneurship. During a recession, businesses and individuals may be forced to adapt to new economic conditions and develop new products or services to meet changing consumer demands. This can create new opportunities for growth and job creation. It is important to remain vigilant and take steps to mitigate the potential impact of a downturn, such as diversifying the economy, strengthening safety nets for workers and businesses, and maintaining open and constructive dialogue between governments, businesses, and other stakeholders. Ultimately, it's through collaboration and strategic planning that we can emerge from a recession stronger and more resilient than ever before. All right, moving on to our next trend for today, the most popular method of outreach in B2B in 2023. You might think it's social media, SEO, or even cold calling, but guess what? It's email marketing. Marketing, marketing, super, super fabulous. Now, before we talk about this in more depth, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, drop us a like, and don't forget to turn on notifications. Okay, moving on. So email marketing has been around for quite some time, but it remains the most effective platform for B2B outreach. In fact, research shows that email marketing has a higher ROI than even social media marketing, making it an essential tool for businesses that want to reach out to their target audience. If you Google the most effective outreach platforms, email marketing is showing more effective than social media marketing for several reasons. First, email campaigns can be easily tracked and optimized for better results, which means that businesses can refine their approach over time to achieve higher conversion rates. Second, email is a more reliable platform for reaching customers than other channels that are subject to algorithm changes. Finally, email marketing allows businesses to communicate directly with their customers in a more personalized way, which can help them build trust and loyalty. One of the key advantages of email marketing for B2B outreach is its ability to deliver targeted messages to specific groups of customers. By segmenting their email list based on factors such as industry, company size, or job title, businesses can create tailored messages that are more likely to resonate with their target audience. This helps to increase the effectiveness of B2B outreach campaigns and drive higher conversion rates. 
Just to give you a few quick examples of targeted messaging, I had a client that works solely with e-commerce companies. In the better personalize our emails as much as possible, we researched each prospect to find out what exact platform they were on, and we included this information as merge tags in our templates. Our open rate on our campaigns after implementing these merge tags went up by 30%. I also had a client that specializes in CRO optimization, and they wanted to make the email stand out. So we included website traffic for all the prospects and implemented that info into the templates as well. Overall, focusing heavily on tailored messaging is something that can be used not only with email marketing, but due to being able to utilize merge tags, it just runs smoothest with email marketing. In conclusion, email marketing is still the most effective platform for B2B outreach. Its ability to deliver targeted messages, track results, and build trust with customers makes it an essential tool for businesses that want to reach their target audience and drive sales. By investing in email marketing campaigns and optimizing their approach over time, businesses can achieve a higher ROI and build long-lasting relationships with their customers. All right, to sum things up, whether you're worried about the recession, whether you're trying to find the best platform for B2B outreach, or you simply want to keep up with the latest trends, keep one important thing in mind. You are unique. And even if things get hard, I know for a fact that each and every one of us has something to bring to the table. And no recession or incorrect platform can truly hide your value. Continue learning, adapting, innovating, and always give your best. All right, all right. That's all the time that I have for today. And if you watch till the end, no better time than the present to leave us a comment on your major 2023 trends that you're seeing already. Stay tuned for more videos on trends coming your way. I'll see you later.